Hello again, everyone. Edwin Lerner back once again. In this YouTube astrological segment, I'm going to be dissertating and talking about the North Node transiting the fourth house in a natal chart. Now, on average, the North Node will traverse a house for approximately a year and a half. However, if your house size is a little bit larger than average, then the North Node will be in there for a little bit of a longer duration. If your house size is a little bit smaller than average, then the North Node will be in there for a little bit of a shorter period. Well, anyway, people, first thing I'll look at, when the North Node transits one's natal fourth house, this could be a, a period uh, that you may have the, this karmic mission or purpose to dedicate time to your home life. Keep in mind that the south node it would would be in the tenth house by transit at this time, and this could indicate that you may have been dominated by career interests, your ambitions, your reputation, notoriety, and recognition. And this is a time where you may have neglected perhaps home and family life. There may have been a debilitated parent or, or fa prominent family member that maybe needs some assistance at this time. It could be some home renovations or repairs that may need to be taken care of that you've avoided maybe uh, because you've been dominated by your career and perhaps even your stature in, in life, your social status. And now is the time where it comes that the North Node by transit is often about issues we need to address and confront. And during this time, there may very well be issues that need to be addressed as far as the home life goes. I'll be having the North Node transiting my fourth house, I believe, in around eight or nine months. And I'm I'm already feeling I need to, to address some issues connected with my home life. So anyway, what's interesting is that, I don't know how many of you know this, but renowned author uh, Alex Haley, who wrote the book Roots, and, I, and there was a movie made about that too, uh, he has, in, in his natal chart, he has the North Node in his fourth house. And interestingly enough, the fourth house does correspond with our roots and he has it he had it in libra which is connected with relationships and i thought that was very very interesting and what he basically in his life what he did was he gained the notoriety and acclaim which was from that maybe the, the south node in the 10th house of career notoriety and he brought it to where uh brought it brought it home so to speak being in uh, in the fourth house, things connected with family, perhaps maybe even someone connected maybe well back in this family tree somewhere. So those are some things uh, really, or people that he saw as his family being African American, if you understand what I'm saying. So those are, uh, the, and it was connected with his roots. So he got notoriety for something connected uh, with his roots by writing uh, this. And I thought that was very interesting. Now, what's also, um, what this is about too, people, is when you have this transit, keep in mind that the fourth house is also, uh, it's about the emotional security. And this could be a time where you get your got want to get in touch with the things that really make you emotionally secure. And it, it, it might be something where you might have thought that emphasizing and accentuating career matters in your livelihood were those things. But then when you when this transit occurs, I think what happens with a lot of people, they become cognizant that it really wasn't. Now, if people are at the time of this video when, that it's being made, is that the North Node currently is transiting Virgo, and of course the South Node is in Pisces. So if somebody's having this transit now, with the North Node uh, in Virgo, South Node in Pisces, well, the South Node in Pisces being transiting the 10th house 
could indicate perhaps maybe some deception and delusion in career matters. And it might have been something where maybe this person felt, for example, that what they were doing was going to be, they deluded themselves into thinking that their career was going to be their all to end means of happiness. Or maybe they thought they were, they were going to be making more money than they actually are, for example, by deluding themselves and deceiving themselves. And then what happens is, North Node in Virgo kind of grounds them into reality, so to speak. Virgo is pragmatic and practical and is about really uh, doing things practical now that are connected with your home base, getting in touch perhaps with your roots, your traditions. You might be, it might be a time w where you're interested perhaps in your genealogy, your ancestry, and you've been putting, procrastinating and putting something off on this. And it's a time now where you may want to look and see who your ancestors maybe were, uh, some of them that you're not really, you're not sure of, and you go on to like ancestry.com uh, in order to find this out. And also the fourth house is connected with our end of life. So uh, especially if you're an older person, this could be a time now where you may really be looking at getting things uh, prepared for that end of life, getting some kind of, uh, Maybe, maybe some kind of account or retirement plan if you've stalled or procrastinated on this. Now that maybe you you really might have taken care of some things connected with your career, maybe this is the time now where you could put some money into some kind of account where you can save if you have any children especially and in people that you may people in your family that may be left uh, left behind when you pass and, and have something set aside for them and getting that planned out so those are some things to look at as far as this transit goes and it could be too the 10th house is about the reputation and maybe what what you could be doing is bringing some of that uh, that 10th house uh, south node energy a little bit into the fourth, not eradicating the, ten, the south node and the 10th house. 10th house energy completely, but really just uh, maybe not, not emphasizing as much and incorporating a little bit into the fourth house, such as taking the, rep, the thing about reputation in the 10th house and bringing it into the fourth and maybe getting a reputation for being somebody that could be very loyal and steadfast to, to the person's home and family. Well, anyway, people, it's also important to look at the aspects, if any, that are made by this transit to, to your points in your natal chart is this could impact the transit. Now, let's say, for example, that the transiting north node is making a conjunction to your natal Saturn. Well, this could be perhaps may have an all encompassing need, perhaps two responsibilities in devoting time to some kind of laborious work and being in the fourth house, this could be connected with work associated with the home and family. Now let's take another example. Let's say that the transit north node is making a sextile or trine to your natal Uranus. This could be auspicious for incorporating ingenuity into the area of life that needs development. And being in the fourth house, this could be somehow connected uh, with the home. Well, anyway, people, that will conclude this YouTube astrological segment for the North Node transiting the fourth house in a natal chart. And stay tuned next time where I'll be dissertating and talking about the North Node transiting the fifth house in a natal chart. Two things I want to get with you on before I head out. Firstly, the stars may impel, but do not compel. And secondly, never isolate any single astrological element, aspect, planetary placement, position, configuration, influence, or what have you, and make an analysis of a person, astrologically speaking, based on this alone. Because astrologically speaking, the person is the sum of all their components in their natal chart, and not just one. Until next time, people, stay well.